Welcome to the CKA Certification Series Part 23. In this video we will cover a question related with config map. This time we can take this question from Killer Coda. Choose this scenario. Why this time we are choosing a question from Killer Coda? Because the same question you will face in the examination. The first question is for creating two config maps. Create a config map names true wide with content tree equals true wide. This is the first config map. After that, we need to create a config map from a YAML file. It is stored under slash root slash. Let's create the first config map. We can take the help. Take this as reference. Okay. The first config map is created, let's confirm it. We can see the key is tree and the value is true wide. Okay, let's create the second config map. Actually it is stored in a YAML file, so we only need to just apply that. Name of the config map is Burke, and it has three key in the values. Let's apply the YAML file. Let's describe it. We can see three key and three values. OK, just validate it. Validation is successful. The next question is to create a pod. And we need to mount these config maps through environment variable and volume mount. The question is create a pod named pod1 with image engine x and make a key tree of config map true wide available as environment variable tree1. Which means we need to create an environment variable tree1 and pass the key tree of the config map true wide into it. Next task is to mount all keys of config map berk. As volume, the files should be available under slash etc slash berk. Which means, we need to mount the config map break as a volume to the pod specific path. After that we need to test. Okay, let's create the pod first. Just remove unwanted lines. First, we can configure the environment variable. Name should be tree1.
Okay, we can take the help of documentation. Search for config map. Take this as reference. Config map name should be true wide. Key should be tree. Okay, we are past first config map through environment variable. Next, we need to mount the second config map, so go to the documentation again. Take this volume mount as reference. Provide a name. Okay, this means items in the volume Burke will be mounted to the pods location slash etc slash Burke. Next, we need to declare config map as volume, so go to the documentation. We can declare under the spec. Provide a volume name. Config map should be break. OK. Now we have mounted the config map break to the pod through volume mounting. Let's save and exit. Let's apply. Our pod is creating. OK, our pod is running. Let's test now.
Okay, environment variable is there, next we need to check the volume mounts. Volume mount also there. Okay, let's validate it. Yes, validation is successful, congratulations, we have successfully completed this question, and you can expect this question in the examination. Thank you for watching this video, if you felt this is useful then, please do like and subscribe.